Hey, what's up guys? This is Foryam again, back with a new Minecraft Dungeons video. Welcome to the What If series, an experimental series where I cheat a little bit to show you impossible and very overpowered enchantment combos. I bet you're all very curious how Triple Prospector, heck Quadruple Prospector would work on a weapon, and what about 4 times Luck of the Sea on armor? Well, in this series I do exactly that. Showcase combos which are not possible to get your hands on in the game, so let's check them out right now. This video was made for showcase purposes only. All items are destroyed in the end. No ocelots were harmed while making this video. I cannot say the same for the zombies. I don't encourage cheating as it can ruin your game. Trading modded items can get you banned. Croissant, baguette, saucisson, that's all. Welcome back guys to a awesome new episode for this what if quadruple enchantments in Minecraft Dungeons. Today we're going to showcase one that is going to be pretty painful. But guys, I am very excited to show you the quadruple pain cycle. So right here I have a bone cudgel and boy oh boy, I did some pretty crazy showcases in the past videos. If you haven't checked them out yet, definitely make sure to visit the playlist. There are some pretty crazy combos, but once again right now we have quadruple pain cycle guys this is a pretty crazy enchantment which uh, pretty much does this attacking drains your life to grant one stack of pain cycle at five stacks your pain is channeled into your next attack to deal quintuple the damage on the highest tier guys this is pretty insane it's gonna be either very painful for us or extremely painful for the enemies so let's first showcase one pain cycle at the target dummy actually let's equip this bad boy for a second i also decided to go with the bone cudgel because it looks extremely funky and of course hits like a truck we're gonna do some home runs guys let's check it out so with no attack speed this one hits pretty slow, but every time when we hit, of course, we lose some HP. And then the last hit, of course, also loses some HP. But right now, our pain cycle is ready to do the trick. We also shine pretty evil, guys, with some black matter behind us look at that so right now if we hit the target enemy bam five million damage with one single hit so uh, that is pretty funky right i am very curious what this is gonna do with two times the pain cycle so if we hit the target enemy it deals one million damage we stack it once and uh, of course we lose 56,000 hp remember that guys 56,000. let's just stack it once again so normal hit 1 million, right now 5 million damage, I'm gonna drink a potion, let's crack this up to a double paid cycle, oh man, this is gonna be so crazy, so I assume we get to get our hands on double the stacks right now, yes we do, we do only lose 56,000 HP, and um, what did happen right there was pretty funky, so actually every time of course we stack it up, we will lose this because simply we go to 2 to 5, then 4 to 5, and the third hit is actually the 5 to 5, but we're actually going to 6 to 5, pretty much resetting the effect. You Look at that. We simply lose our HP right now, not allowing us to stack it to 5 to 5. So let's try um, the triple ones, right? I want to know what that does. We still only lose 56,000, but right now we stack to 3 to 5. The second hit also gets rid of the stacks. Oh man, this is so bad. Why? Just why? I mean, if only we had a weapon with built-in pain cycle, then, only then, we can insta-hit with the pain cycle stack. That's gonna deal so much damage, guys. But first, I'm gonna try with another pain cycle right here. So four times pain cycle on the bone cudgel. So just one hit. 56,000, wait a second, 500,000 HP, right? No, 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 we actually lose all the HP with well, every single pain cycle. Of course, we lose the 56,000, so we actually lose 200,000 HP with one single slam. Look at this, guys, 1.3 million right there. We go to 1.1 million, so indeed, we lose 200,000. So guys, unfortunately, the Bone Cudgel is a pretty painful quadruple enchantment item to see because the pain cycle simply doesn't allow us to stack to exactly five. I mean, if we get four pain cycles on this one, the first swing is going to give us four stacks, which is very awesome. We also lose four times more HP, but then the second swing would bring us to eight, meaning we don't hit exactly five, and that is necessary for the pain cycle to be ready. So so 
yes, pretty disappointing to see in my opinion, but uh, let me just throw in some pretty funky enchantments of this bow cudgel to see how much damage we can deal with it with a pretty crazy combo. All right, so guys, behold my new bone cudgel. This one right here is gonna hit like a truck. So we have deal extra damage of the pain cycle, also a built-in critical hit on tier three. We're gonna try to deal massive damage, guys, with also a maximum amount of dynamo stacks, and then of course a bonus 33% damage of the sharpness. So my goal right here is to first get the pain cycle stacks ready, then roll 20 times to get dynamo stacked up to the maximum and then of course with the sharpness and hopefully a proccing crit we can deal so much damage we're gonna blow up this target demi so first off let's just hit this guy for a couple times so right now the pain cycle is stacked up and ready now it's time to do some rolls maybe um, we have some feathers that's gonna definitely help us out a little bit doesn't look like it, but um, man, oh man. After these 20 rolls, I have a 20% chance to proc my crit, and I'm very, very curious how much damage we're gonna deal with this one. All right, guys, here we are with 20 stacks. We have a 20% chance of progging that crit. And boy, oh boy, if it's going to be there, this damage is going to be insane. All right, so uh, we also have the gong, right? I'm going to use the gong. We don't have a strength potion, but this is going to be pretty funky. Here we go. Gong of weakening. Bam! 147 million damage right there. We didn't even crit this bad boy, so that means we can deal even more damage. I'm gonna stack one more time to see if we are a little bit lucky, but then we can just also do the math right. While rolling, I'm also restocking the merchants with a hope to find a feather so uh, we can speed up this process, but it doesn't look like we'll be able to find one. Anyways, 20 stacks once again. Are you guys ready? Gog of Weakening. Bam! 179 million damage right there, guys. We did crit this guy. Oh my god. Was it 170 million or even more? I didn't see it perfectly fine, but you guys can just rewind the video. Anyways, this was pretty impressive, right? Wow. We also have 20 stacks, so let's just um, check out a ranged weapon for a second. Okay, this one also has overcharge and dynamo. Let me just gong this one. 226. Was it uh, 226,000 or million? I think, guys. Oh my god. Anyways, that was it for the bone cudgel. Unfortunately, no quadruple paint cycle possible, but um, you can tell that this combination of enchantments is extremely powerful. You can actually get your hands on it in the game, so you should do that, guys. It's gonna be great fun to one-hit kill those bosses. All right, but uh, right now, it's time to say farewell to our friends. Cheerio. All right, so there you have it, a very overpowered enchantment combo. What did you think of this one? Any ideas for the next showcase? Make sure to leave them in the comments down below. And of course, a big thanks for watching. Make sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed watching this video. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe. It is entirely free and a lot more is coming your way. Remember, I do this for showcase purposes only and delete every item in the end. We don't allow modded items on the Discord and cheating can get you banned. Right now though, it's 4am out. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Peace.